Sydney and Melbourne have have flight a fight rather on their hands after Cricket Australia revealed it has not locked in its hallmark cricket test in both cities. Reid Butler explains why from the MCG. Say if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But it does appear that Cricket Australia is potentially keen for some kind of shake-up here. It is preparing to go to official tender for its seven-year suite of international cricket. The MCG, of course, it is synonymous with the Boxing Day test, but it is not locked in here. Other cities have expressed interest, including Perth with Optus Stadium. Victoria really can't afford to lose another major sporting event. We've already had the Com Games debacle. If we say goodbye to the Boxing Day test, then we would likely have to say goodbye to our men of the nation's sporting capital. That's why the Victorian government is trying hard to keep it here. It points to the fact that the MCG uh, is the biggest stadium in the country. It can sit around 100,000 fans. Hopefully uh, that uh, has some effect on this decision here. Uh, it's not set in stone either for the SCG and the New Year's Day test. That's not locked in, so there could be some changes on the way. It all comes down to what Cricket Australia wants, what works best for its coffers. A decision on all of this is expected by Christmas.